Sad news. Queen Camilla forced to drop the Queen title by King Charles. It was a shocking moment for the world. Queen Camilla losing her title, not because of public opinion or scandal. It was her husband, King Charles, who made the decision. What could have led to such a move in the famous royal family? Royal titles carry centuries of tradition, power, and duty. So, when Queen Camilla was forced to drop her title by King Charles, everyone was stunned. Why would a couple, united by love and years of overcoming challenges, make such a drastic choice? Let's explore the royal intrigue behind this surprising event. But first, a brief history lesson. The royal title, a crown of responsibilities, not just jewels. The title of queen seems like a symbol of prestige and splendor. Who wouldn't want to be queen, right? They wear gold crowns and purple robes, followed by servants and fans. But the crown comes with big expectations. A queen is a figurehead, diplomat, and symbol of stability. Queen Camilla knew the pressures well. After years of media scrutiny and comparisons, she became the queen she was prepared for. But could the title have become too much for her? Was it the constant public eye or something deeper in the royal system? <clears throat> queen Camilla, the unlikely rise to royalty. Before we look at the shocking moment, let's understand Camilla's journey to royalty. It was far from easy. Camilla wasn't welcomed at first. She was seen as the villain in a love triangle. Diana was the people's princess, loved and untouchable. Camilla was the interloper, disrupting the fairy tale. It took decades for Camilla to win over the British public. Through charity and supporting King Charles, she softened her image. She became a respected royal figure. But why would Camilla give up her title after all her effort? Was the royal system too rigid, or was there something personal? A sudden shift. Why King Charles requested the change? The big question is why King Charles, after fighting for Camilla's acceptance, asked her to drop her title. This move surprised everyone and sparked many theories. Was it part of a plan to modernize the monarchy? King Charles wants a leaner, less expensive royal family. Maybe the queen title was too tied to the past, and Charles wanted to give Camilla a title that fits their future vision. Or could Camilla have asked for the change herself? The pressure of being compared to other queens might have been too much. Maybe she prefers supporting Charles rather than being in the spotlight as queen. Even royal families face the same doubts and relationship issues as everyone else. Could this have been a personal choice between husband and wife, not a royal decree? <sighs> the emotional toll, a relatable challenge we all face. Imagine stepping into a role that the world has preordained for someone else. It's hard enough to navigate regular life with the weight of expectations on your shoulders. But imagine doing it on a global stage, where every move is scrutinized, judged, and analyzed. Many of us can relate to the pressures of living up to expectations, whether from family, society, or our own internalized standards, it's a common struggle. Camilla's situation isn't so different from what we all experience in some form. She's been playing a role that the world never really prepared her for, just as many of us do in our jobs, relationships, or personal lives. This emotional burden is something we all face. The difference is that Camilla's decision to step back from the Queen title gives us a rare, public glimpse into a truth we all grapple with. Sometimes, for our own well-being, we need to set down the weight of expectations and make decisions that are right for us, even if others don't understand them. Have you ever had to make a decision that went against what everyone expected of you? What was the outcome? How did you feel after taking that step? A strategic move? What's next for Camilla? There's a powerful lesson in this entire royal saga. Just because you can do something doesn't always mean you should. Camilla had the title of queen, but did it truly serve her or the monarchy? In fact, by shedding the queen title, Camilla might be positioning herself for an even more powerful role. With fewer expectations tied to the heavy title of queen, she could focus more on initiatives that truly resonate with her values. Camilla has always been a champion for issues like domestic abuse and literacy. Perhaps this move allows her to double down on these causes, free from the distractions of royal protocol. There's also speculation that this is part of a broader rebranding for the monarchy, one that keeps it relevant in the 21st century. With younger royals like William and Kate leading a new generation, perhaps the monarchy is beginning to shift its image away from rigid titles and towards one based on actions and impact. And let's not forget the public. By stepping back from the queen title, 
Camilla could be seen as a more relatable figure, one who understands the importance of humility and service over mere titles. The big question, was this the right move? At the end of the day, the question remains, was this decision the right one? And more importantly, who was it truly for? Camilla? King Charles? The British public? While some might view it as a loss of status, others might see it as an empowering move that reflects the ever-changing nature of royalty in the modern world. Royal titles have evolved over centuries, but so too has public opinion. What once was seen as a status symbol could now be seen as a relic of a bygone era. The truth is, this decision could be a strategic masterstroke that ensures the survival of the monarchy for generations to come. By embracing change and shedding the old, the royal family might be showing us all the way forward, where what we do is more important than what we are called. What do you think? Is the royal family on the right track by shaking up traditions? Or do titles like Queen still carry an irreplaceable value in today's world? Conclusion The Future of the Royal Family The news of Camilla dropping her Queen title is undeniably shocking, but it's also a reflection of how the royal family must continuously adapt to stay relevant. As King Charles steers the monarchy into uncharted waters, decisions like these show us that even the most enduring institutions must evolve. As we look to the future, one thing is clear. The role of the royal family is changing, and with it, our perceptions of power, tradition, and responsibility. Queen Camilla's decision to relinquish her title is not just a royal matter. It's a reminder to all of us about the importance of authenticity and finding our true roles in life, even if that means letting go of the expectations that come with prestigious titles. So, what's your take? Should royal traditions be kept sacred? Or is it time for a more modern approach to monarchy? Share your thoughts, and let's keep the conversation going. <clears throat> Call to action. Join the discussion. What do you think about Camilla's decision to drop the Queen title? Was it a strategic move or a necessary personal choice? Comment below and share your thoughts on the future of the British monarchy. Don't forget to share this article with others who are just as curious about the royal family's next chapter. Legacy and Reflection The Weight of Tradition Tradition is fascinating in the British monarchy, where history and heritage are everywhere. For centuries, royals have followed these traditions, sometimes at the cost of personal freedom. When Queen Camilla was crowned, many thought it was the end of a long saga. She had claimed her place alongside King Charles after years of being seen as an outsider. But by stepping back from the Queen title, she sparked a new debate about tradition in today's world. This decision affects Camilla, King Charles, and the royal family as a whole. With modernity changing even the oldest institutions, we wonder, how much of the past should we keep? Should tradition evolve to reflect new values? Queen Camilla's journey shows that letting go of a title can be a gain. It's a chance to redefine what that title means and whether it's still needed. What traditions have you held on to? And when have you let them go? Did you feel liberated or conflicted by that choice? <clears throat> what this means for King Charles' reign. King Charles wants to modernize the monarchy. He's talked about streamlining the royal household and focusing on causes that matter to the public. This isn't just about saving money. It's about keeping the monarchy relevant. Camilla dropping her queen title could be part of this plan. It's a bold move, showing a departure from the monarchy's past. Instead of old titles, King Charles and Queen Camilla might focus on substance over status. The royal family has always adapted to public sentiment. From Queen Elizabeth II's televised coronation to Prince Harry and Meghan Markle stepping back, they've evolved. But Camilla's decision feels different, more intentional, more strategic. It could change how we see the monarchy in the future. Will this be remembered as the moment King Charles ushered the monarchy into the 21st century? Only time will tell, but one thing is certain. The royals are no strangers to reinvention. <clears throat> Lessons we can all take from Camilla's choice. This story isn't just about royal titles. It's about personal choices. We've all faced situations where we felt obligated to stick with something. Camilla's decision is a reminder that sometimes, the bravest thing we can do is let go. It's not always easy to walk away from something that carries so much weight. But there's immense power in choosing the path that's right for you, even if it goes against the grain. We often see royals as being different from us, but their challenges are similar. Camilla's story is one of resilience, reinvention, and self-awareness. She spent years fighting for her place in a system that wasn't designed for her, 
and now she's choosing to redefine what that place looks like. Next time you face a tough decision, think of Queen Camilla. She chose to drop the Queen title, finding a role that felt right for her. How can you apply her wisdom to your life? <clears throat> the global impact, how the world reacted to the news. The news of Queen Camilla stepping back from her title sparked reactions worldwide. People from all walks of life shared their thoughts on what this means for the monarchy's future. Some saw it as a positive change, showing the royal family's evolution. Others felt it was a step back, threatening the monarchy's traditions. The media buzzed with questions. Would this change the future of royal titles? Could others follow suit? What impact would it have on the Commonwealth? As the world waits for answers, it's clear that Camilla's decision reflects a cultural shift. It values individuality and authenticity over strict roles. But what do you think? Should the royal family blend tradition with modernity? Is it time to rethink titles like Queen? <clears throat> the power of reinvention. What the future holds for Camilla. With the Queen title behind her, Camilla's future is full of possibilities. She can focus on her passions and values away from comparisons. She has championed causes like literacy and women's rights. Now, she can dedicate more time to these efforts without the ceremonial duties. Camilla might also take on a quieter role in the royal family. Her loyalty and resilience will continue to support the monarchy, even without the queen title. In conclusion, Camilla's future looks bright. Dropping the queen title was a strategic move, allowing her to find a more authentic role. <clears throat> Final thoughts. Is this the beginning of a new royal era? Reflecting on Queen Camilla's decision, we see a story of transformation. It's about knowing when to hold on and when to let go. It's about making choices that reflect who you are, even if they challenge others' expectations. The monarchy has survived by adapting to the world. Camilla's decision is part of this long history of evolution. Whether seen as a bold move or a loss, it marks the start of a new era for the royal family.